High Priestess, you are Psychic, Clairvoyant, Seven of Cups, Three of Wands. Someone wanted to block you, keep you waiting. You're going to see what you need. This could be a sister or an auntie. Maybe you feel like you cannot see what you need. Seven of Cups. It seems like there. you may feel like there's too much going on around you. Too many options. But there is one. There is a way. You know, there is a pathway. And someone knows it. And someone knows that you are close to discovering this pathway. And this person is afraid because you are right there. It is just like there's only a thin veil that is between you and what you want to manifest here. But I'm getting someone knows it and they can feel that you are about to have this breakthrough. You're about to break, you're about to make the right selection. It's right at the tip of your fingers. All right, so don't stop going. This person, they were trying to block you in your sleep. They wanted to take your dreams or they did not want you to fulfill your dreams. Someone was trying to do reverse spells energy so that instead of what you touch turning to gold, what you touch would be difficult or hard to turn to gold. Someone wanted to take your powers, your psychic powers. Someone wanted to disempower you and leave you without. Now we have to figure out, I guess, why this person wanted to leave you without any power. Um, I don't, I feel like it is, bec maybe it is because of some truth, some information that you have, that this person wanted to steal it away from you. Your gifts, your truth, your talents, and leave you powerless so that they could go off with what, this person is a thief, so that they could go off with what is yours and not return with it. They were going to go scramble with your, your something. I hear evidence. I hear chakra. And they were going to try to, fix, like, try to pull it up. Whatever this is, go into it. Um, this could be like they wanted your number to get into your device. They were trying to hack, to get into, to configure something beautiful soul magician in order to make what is yours work for them. Destiny. But there, this person is still realizing that what is meant for you is meant for you. So this person is having a hard time making what is yours work for them. I'm getting your birthright. I'm getting someone stole your information. And someone did not give you information, Cancerian, that you are supposed to be receiving. And they thought that they would keep it from you until a certain time that they could use it for themselves. But somehow you're just on the brink of a breakthrough. You're just right there. I'm telling you, it's like we're right there. It's right there. We're hot is the energy, not cold. You're hot on, on someone's tail. And this person is close to you. I feel like you wouldn't believe. This person is close to you. This person is a thief for your abundance. They wanted your life, your lifestyle, your inheritance, your wealth. For some, they did not want you to have your inheritance. I hear bridge a bridge. They wanted to like for real keep some like keep everything from you. Joy, perception, and miracle. Someone did not want you to have blessings and breakthrough. Midas touch. I'm hearing again breakthroughs. Someone. Is either they, they saw that you were just getting closer and closer, so they, they decided to go behind your back and sabotage you. And then they came around you still and um, like acted like they were on your team, but they are not. This person is not. But your ancestors are here for you and they're here with you, guiding you through this process. And I feel like they have never been worried about you or worrying about you. This person, they will go down. Yeah. They will go. They will. They will. Yeah, they're going to. Mm -hmm. All right. Next card. Five of Cups. This is, They wanted you to feel that energy of loss and despair. And then you would go around and complain to them. And they would go, oh. 
but the whole time they were the one that was setting it up this person it could be a relative or someone close to your family i hear stream someone wanted to block your stream of income your progress king of diamonds and for some this is about a man in your life that someone did not want you to get recognition they did not want you to get health wealth fame success let's say someone was going to come around and select the best person they wanted to like make you stress and sabotage you and make you struggle so that you wouldn't be an option so you wouldn't feel good about yourself so that someone would not think that you are worthy of something and they is either they wanted it for themselves or they just feared you having substantial income and well-being someone feared your progress someone just did not want you to have it maybe some some something about the things that you were talking about I'm also getting this person is a seer in some way or they they're sensitive so they felt like you were about to some they like they or they got a reading done on you and they felt like something good was about to happen in your life I hear take back your power and so this person felt like because something good was happening for you some type of a breakthrough it would have put them back it would have set them back or exposed them in some way okay that's what i am getting this is like some truth about someone in your family but the most has always been with you yeah nine of wands is the energy of your spirit guide your spirit team surrounding you it is also a confirmation of all that you've been through energetically this person they wanted to defame you embarrass you humiliate you put negative energy on you bad eye you bad energy you make people not not wanting to trust in you believe in you this person was doing all of that to you not wanting pe you to believe in yourself wanting you to feel anxious and shy they just wanted you to not know who you are they could control you better that way and i'm telling you this is someone that does this behind the scenes and then they come around and talk in your face seven of cups so i feel like you're cutting this person off as you're finding out the truth you're disconnecting this could be a person from your past a person you went to school with this person thought that they were smarter than you or more spiritually inclined. They were even doing candle work and they thought that you would not know. Whatever they were doing behind your back, ten of swords energy, they thought that you would never find out. You would never come to know about this, this, these things that they were doing. Someone was afraid. This person is afraid. So, like people are afraid of you becoming successful because they somehow knows they know what it means to them either you're gonna leave them behind or you're gonna choose better or you're gonna see the truth about them or they're not going to be able to be um enough for you or something along those lines and i feel like as you are coming to see the truth it is becoming clearer and clearer what it is that you need to do and what it is that you need to change and let go off of these things that you thought meant something to you in your life they are what's been holding you back and these karmic people they knew the truth all along and they were like they were depending upon you depending relying upon you holding on to these heavy stones these burdens carrying these this weight with you even though they know that it, it just was useless and they heard you complaining about these things and they never once said stop carrying them put them down because they knew that when you bear these burdens you it made you weak or less aware of yourself feeling nothing without you just waiting not having you it makes me sad done I can't wait for a new beginning. Someone was living off of your energy. Ten of, that, ten of swords is what the card is. Is what is written on the card. Your downfall. They were planning it and praying on it all along. It could be a feminine energy or a masculine energy. Okay, next card. But you are risen up. This card says you are a bad. You know what? Red, rising to the fullness of your potential. And someone is scared. I need you to be perseverant and keep doing what you're doing. You're about to have this breakthrough from root spells that these people have been doing on you. Nine of Cups, you're about to find your happiness, wish fulfillment, and this is also in a person or in a job. 
as you get to know the truth and know who is the wolves in sheep's clothing around you who are pretending to be a friend but literally are family but just trying to just use your energy oh my gosh the ace of diamonds believe in yourself you see how i believe that things would turn around for you and you would get your wealth back your health back this is the energy someone is, you're actually breaking free financially maybe you need to work on your belief in self because this is what someone has been trying to work on too manipulating how you feel how you think especially when they try to make people gaslight you or make you feel like you're you're not good enough it affects your confidence in self it that's it, it decreases your sense of happiness and therefore decreases your productivity and your manifestation and that is the state that someone wanted you in it just made them sit better or feel better about themselves i'm telling you but this person is losing control they're losing control. They may feel like they're they're vigorous and they're actually in control of your energy because this person is watching you. Like I say, they're close to you. But know that you have this information. You've got to outsmart this person and do something unthinkable, unexpected. And you've got to believe in yourself. Seven of Diamonds. A lot of prosperity follow guidance maybe some of you need to talk to a spiritual healer a counselor someone else a mentor right to get this energy off of you for, to heal these feelings of insecurity and like multiply your income sure prosperity sober welcome to a place of magic hopeful expectation welcoming well-being hopeful prosperity this is the light energy that someone saw in you sure prosperity sober that means it feels like you are in alignment with the universe and things are working out for you these people were jealous so you were in welcome in to a place of magic right that was your energy hopeful expectations everything was working out for you hopeful prosperity everything is working out for you everything continues to work for you everything continues to manifest beautifully for you things just align productivity health and well-being how you speak it into being welcome in well-being you are the evidence of your goodness you are the evidence of your well-being so when people look at you they can see that well things are working out you do look happy you do look healthy you do look well and that is the energy that they wanted to siphon off of you daydreamer and eyes full of stars they've always been watching you and trying to intertwine with your your source your connection and they were stalking you seven of swords stern strict focused determined they were stalking you and planning but divine energy surround you beautiful soul your last card is ace of cups divine energy surround you you are protected. Someone has to give you back everything that they took from you. Something about a mother or a virgin or Mary, um, the virgin Mary mother. You, you, okay, someone is learning about you right now. You don't play and you don't back down. Ace of cups and ace of diamonds surround you. Ace of wands. This is your money energy today. Love, health, wealth, prosperity in abundance. And I'll leave it right here. All is well, all is within you, beautiful soul. No weapons formed against you shall prosper. Remember that you are close. It is right here. You're on the brink of it. Listen well. Trust your intuition. You're on the right path. You're on the money. Everything is working out in your favor. Right? You are loved. You are an inspiration. The seven of diamonds energy. You sure prosperity surrounds you. You are attractive, you're beautiful, you're blessed, you're abundant, you're joyful, you're fertile, you're virile, you get what you want. So you're taking your power back and it is disempowering and crippling someone. Someone is like drying up and withering. I'm sorry. Like I don't it's like I don't even want to see it because we're all one thing. So I don't even want to but I'm telling you this is the energy of some enemy that was taking from you. I pray that you continue to manifest and generate your own sense of income in abundance, your own sense of love that no one can give to you, take from you. Your well-being blossoms. Your, your money is like springing up. 
believe in yourself your money is growing you planted the right seeds your health is growing your wealth your your confidence your stability happiness surrounds this too joy um clarity um fulfillment pleased satisfaction you feeling proud you feel good about yourself. You feel good that you did this. You feel good about the journey you're on. You feel good about your talents, your multiple successes. You feel good about the place that you are and the things that you've done. You feel good about who you are. You feel you look around you and you see things working out in your favor. You know you're a good person. You know there's so much more to come. You know that you're valuable. You know that you're rich. You are worthy. You know that you are worth being invested in. You know that you're worth all the health, wealth, and money that is coming into your life. Prosperity, richness. You know that you are worth all of it. It is yours. You're basking in it and it keeps becoming more and more and more. You know, there's no short supply. It is here. You are well. All is well. This is yours. It is yours. You're on the right path. All is well and all is within you, beautiful soul. Take it easy out there. Much love and thanks so much for all of your abundant show of support on the journey. I love you. May God continue to bless you, guide you, strengthen you, and enhance and increase your wealth, your riches. In the name of the Most High. To the name of the Most High. Through your son, Jesus Christ.